Hi guys, I'm here with, well, let's say they're my favorite review items that I've received recently. Um, so I just wanted to share, I know I show a lot of things that I get for a review and um, I figured I'd show just a couple of my favorite things that I've gotten to review lately and um, that way you'll know which ones are really, really good and if you're interested, then you can go ahead and check them out. I will go ahead and put the links to all of them down below. Um, if I forget, just remind me because I am so forgetful. You guys know that if you've been watching me for a long time. This ain't working so good. Anyway, I'm going to show you my most favorite, favorite thing that I've gotten so far. And I'll show you like a little picture or something of it when it's in use. Um, but it's this Insta Natural Diffuser. I'm in love with this thing. It lights up. <laughs> it runs by wire, so I can't turn it on and show you but it lights up blue, oh my God, and it just, the mist that comes out of it and the scent that comes out of it with all the essential oils um, is pretty amazing. It's really easy to refill and reuse. You just pop this thing right open. It has water in it right now, so I can't kind of tip it over and show you, um, but that's all it is. You just plug it in, in the back. You pop this thing right on after you fill it up in the chamber right there. You fill it up to this little line um, you add a few drops of your favorite essential oils for whatever the reason that you want to use it. Ah, it smells good right now. Um, I think I have vanilla and lavender in here right now because um, I like to use it at night. And you just press this little button and it goes on and it turns off when it's dry and there's no more um, liquid in here. I love this thing. What have I done without an essential oil diffuser? So you just add water and that's it. And when you're, after you use it a few times, you just go and take a little cloth and wipe out the inside and you can just refill it. So I, I don't do it that often, like cleaning it out. I just clean it out once since I've had it and I've used it like dozens of times. So I'm bad, but. So to go along with that are all my essential oils, not all of them, but a few of my essential oils that I've been loving to use. Again, I have the van vanilla here. This is the bergamot one, um, and the bergamot is kind of like for, you can use it for respiratory, you can use it for calming down, you can use it for so many different things. And then the peppermint is really nice. When you put peppermint in the diffuser, it's like bright. Everything is bright. <laughs> no kidding, because it is so like, I don't know, like you can smell it right through the bottle. All of these you can smell right through the bottle. I smell cilantro on my fingers. I was in my garden messing with my my herbs and I can smell cilantro. <laughs> Whatever. And then I have the lavender oil. I have a couple lavender oils that I've been using. This one I got last week so I've been using this one since it's really really small. I wish all of my essential oils had a little tiny dropper like this. It would make it so much easier. These things they have like the little um, tiny spouts in them. Um, they don't drip out or anything. You can turn them over and they normally won't even drip. You have to kind of like take it and like like that to get just a drop out, which is nice because then it's not gonna spill all over the place. But essential oils, been loving it. Um, I'm gonna be doing a swap with somebody. I think she had the sweet orange or something like that. Oh, essential oils, I love them. I wanna try them all, I really do. And so the new ones that I got here, I got the Slumber and the Inhale. I got this from Amazon Review Trader. I'm excited to try these out. This is just a mixture of several of them. So you don't have to um, mix them up yourself. They're already pre-mixed. And when they're pre-mixed like this, they are quite costly. So I was really excited to get this for a buck a piece because I think they're like 20 something dollars a piece when they're pre-mixed with all the different oils for the reason that you need to use it for. Um, so. That's that about my diffuser and my essential oils. Those are, I love those. Those are like my favorite things to use every single day. The next thing is this cool little um, Bluetooth headset. I talked about this the other day, last week or the week before. Um, it's just this little thing here. It pops over on your neck and it just sits there. So if you're not using it, it doesn't really bother you. It's really awesome. And then when you wanna use it, you just pop out one of the ear pieces, pop it in your ear. And when you're done, you can take it off. This is like my favorite one. I have um, one or two other Bluetooth headphones and I really like those a lot. The sound quality actually is a lot better than this one, 
but the wire slides down all the time. Like I don't really know, I normally, when I'm using the headsets, I don't normally wear both of them at the same time. I usually have only one in because I'm like editing videos or listening to YouTube and I'm watching TV at the same time. I'm not like multitasking or, um, you know, watching TV and whatever it is, whatever. Um, so I like that this just sits there and I don't have the wire dangling or anything like that and it doesn't bother me. And it connects to my MacBook even better. Um, where's the other thing? Oh, right here. Um, this one, I remember when I initially got this whew, a couple months ago, this is the Insta Natural Argan Oil Hair Mask. Um, I liked it, it was okay, it wasn't the best um, hair mask that I've ever used. I just kind of thought it was more like a conditioner and not so much like a weekly mask that you can use. But recently, for some odd reason, some weird reason, after I did my review saying that it was just okay, it's freaking good. Like I used it this morning when I washed my hair this morning. Um, I use, but I use a whole glop of it. And I don't know if that's what you're supposed to do with hair masks, but I find that if I use a hair mask and I just use like a light coating all over, it doesn't really do anything. I kind of think it's just like, eh, whatever. But when I use a whole glop of it, like a huge scoop of it, then I'm happy with it. Ooh, let me not even open it because it kind of looks gross. Um, but yeah, I used it this morning and I really liked it. And I've been using it, oh, uh, let's see, like once, no, like twice a week, I want to say. Um, this one and there's another one in, in my shower that I'm using back and forth just so I can kind of use them up. But um, yeah, gloppier, the better. It works. Uh, next, let's see. Oh, this one. I got this to do a review via Expo TV. This is the Seraphil Retaliate. This is like a, just like a clear, it looks like water. It's just clear and it comes in a little dropper like this. And this is for people that are thinning hair, losing hair or whatever. I've been using this um, consistently once, sometimes twice a day, but mostly just once a day. And I just take it and I apply it right here to the front and right, um, like, I'll just take it and I'll go ch -ch -ch, drip it all along the my hairline so it kind of falls backwards and then I'll massage it in and consistently for about oh gosh more than a month and I have I don't know if you can see it I have all these baby hairs look how long they are now my hair is growing a lot and um I have all these baby hairs all over and you can see it sticking up all over my head because I have naturally thin hair, always have been having thin hair and um, I was like, you know what, let me just start using it. I have several bottles of these and I put it in a spot that I know that I'll use it every single time. So um, that helps. Um, so if you're interested and you have that issue, um, this Seraphil, it has minoxidil and it's funny because this particular one when I was testing it out, it didn't have the real packaging on it just yet. And um, it says for women on there, but just to let you know, you can use the one that says for men because they're exactly the same thing. They just changed the label to say for women. Huh. And I bet you ours is more expensive. I bet. Uh, next is this Teddy Organics Rose Water. Oh, I love this. This rose water is amazing. This is like my favorite one that I have, and I have like three or four, maybe, and this one is my favorite one. Um, I just kind of missed it. I, it's funny because I'll take it and I'll put it in different places in the house so that I'll just use it throughout randomly in the day. <laughs> I have them all over the place, but it's just when I see them, then I'll just pick them up and I'll just go ch -ch -ch, mist them all over and I'm good. They feel so nice and refreshing, and if it's really hot outside, it's even better. I just love these things. If you haven't tried rose water, you should definitely try them out. Um, next is from Body Mary. I got this um, serum because I have not tried this particular one. I had said to myself, I'm not going to get any more serums. I have plenty of serums to use, blah, 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 whatever. This one is completely different than all of my serums. I think I mentioned this. Um, it's a orange color. You can see it right there. Um, it's a bright orange color. It has like a, uh, I want to say cucumber-like scent. Um, and it's very light 
and while the the serum is not water like it's not thick and oily like either um, let me see I'll put a little drop on the back of my hand here so that's it you can see that it, it's got it's not water but it's not super um, thick and greasy either like some like argan oil and stuff like that you wouldn't be able to touch anything else after that you have you've pretty much would have to wash your hands because it's so oily. This one has a little bit of slickness to it, but it absorbs like it's almost completely absorbed in now and it's not greasy or sticky or anything and my hand just feels super smooth. I've been loving this. This serum, Age Defense Super 6 Serum. 22% vitamin C, 2% retinol, 20% hyaluronic acid, 2.5% niacinamide. Uh, did I say that right? 2.5% of CoQ10 and 0.5% of some word that I don't know how to say, but really good. I've been loving this. Um, the other serum that I've been loving using, and I use this one first, and then I'll put this one on after. But um, this is from Watts Beauty. I got this through <laughs> one of those review sites that you go to the website and you say you want it and they give you the code one of those places. I saw really amazing reviews on this. So when I saw this, I was like, I gotta have it. I think it was like 20 to $40 is what the price range is of this serum. Um, I paid $1. <coughs> and everybody's reviews was like, oh, um, my wrinkles, or my this, my that, it really works, it really works. I mean, tons and tons of really amazing reviews. So I was like, gotta get that one. And I have to say, um, you're not going to see instant results. You have to use this all the time. I mean, I think I'm down to like less than half the bottle. I'm down here somewhere. Um, and I've been using it consistently twice a day. No, not twice a day consistently. At least once a day, but sometimes twice a day. Um, and I notice I have like a, one wrinkle under my eye here when I smile. And it's like really deep inset wrinkle. Just like one. Like that. I don't know what's I've up I've been with using that. this with in combination with my um what is that thing genu it's called a genu um and it's just like this electro something whatever and it's supposed to stimulate your um, collagen cells and stimulate um you know whatever your skin to kind of get rid of the wrinkles so i've been using that and this consistently and i've noticed that there has been a it's not gone, it's still there. I see it when I smile and I take pictures, but it's less. So I have to say that I think this has something to do with it along with my Genu. Should bring the Genu over, but that's not a review item. At least it's not current. Um, next, I got this one from Buzz Agent. I'm part of that cologne campaign that they have. Um, and this is the Dolce from Dolce & Gabbana. Um, just a little perfume thing. I used it all up already. I really liked it. I thought it was very nice, soft, sweet scent, and I definitely want to buy the full size of this one. So um, I think I might do that. I really like this one a lot. So this I got from, I got this through Thomason. This is called Dream Dots, and what it is is just a, let me show you. It's these little tiny, um, they look almost like Band-Aid dots and they're thicker in the center and they taper out to very thin 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 at the edges you can put it on your skin and it's barely noticeable it just kind of blends into your skin um, I used it I have a blog post that's going to be coming up I'm just waiting for like an approval to post it up um, but I'll have a link to my blog down below in case you want to go check out some pictures and stuff like that um, I put it on a spot I had like a little a spot that was coming up right here it was red and inflamed and painful and I put it on and then the next day I took it off and it wasn't gone but it was definitely subsided and it wasn't painful anymore and um, it did it had a big improvement from that night to the morning um, for my son on the other hand for his skin he's you know preteen he's 12 my middle son and this stuff was like what he wouldn't let me take pictures so he had like this big white head on the tip of his nose. It was disgusting. And I put that thing on his nose the next day, mid-morning. I took it off and it was disgusting and gross. And um, and then I put another one back on right away. And by mid-afternoon, we were going to my, um, my brother's house to go swimming and stuff. And he took it off before we got there. And I was like, 
that thing is gone. It was like gone, completely gone, disappeared. Wasn't red, it didn't have a little hole in his nose. It wasn't, it was perfect. And I was like, man, this stuff is good for him. It worked perfectly for him, for his skin, for the teenage acne kind of a thing. Um, but it was like a, the white pussy looking ugly ones. And so I thought the Dream Dots, he's been using this. This is really, really excellent. Um, so for him, it's perfect. And he really, really likes it. It's not the medicine that you have to stick on your nose or anything like that. And um, he just puts it on and then peels it off and puts another one on. And usually by the second time he puts it on, it's already done. I think all I have is just the one little pad left. It came with, um, I don't know how many, it came with 24 in here and each little strip of these have six in there. So um, this is the last piece that we have left. So that is everything that I have for my recent review items and things that I've been loving lately. Um, if you'd like to see more of these, let me know in the comment section down below. I think this is just a great way to go ahead and do like a review on my favorite things that I've been reviewing lately and kind of get them where I don't have to do like um, all these drawn out videos. I can just condense them and put them all together. So I thought that that was a really good way to kind of say, here's everything. What do you think? <laughs> so that's it, you guys. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you again in another video. Bye.